What's up all you lovely learners out there in learning land? Tyler from 10 coming at you with another guitar tutorial like we do every single Monday. If you like this kind of content, hit subscribe and ring the bell so you never miss a lesson. Today we're doing Come and Get Your Love by Redbone. Four chords, one chord progression, making it a fairly beginner tune, and we're gonna do that little tasty riff at the beginning. Guardians of the Galaxy might be my favorite soundtrack of all time. What's your favorite soundtrack? Leave a comment below. Printable tabs and song sheet for this song and all our tutorials by becoming a Patreon. But we're also gonna have all the information on the screen, so all you really need to learn is your guitar, brain, and attention span. Once you have those three things, follow me on in and let's learn this classic together. Come on in, time to guard the galaxy. All right, why don't we go ahead and just jump right into the intro riff. It is going to sound like this. Okay, and we're only playing three notes. All of this is happening over a D chord too. So if this was too much for you, you could play, you could strum over a D chord a couple of times, right? Pointer finger on the fifth fret of the A string is where we're gonna start, which is a D note. And we're gonna play the seventh fret of our E string to the fifth fret, or a B note to an A note. The A note is the fifth of the D in a chord tone. So this is kind of just a fancy arpeggio, and that's why it sounds so good over a D chord, okay? We're gonna go bam, bam, bam. I'm gonna do it without palm muting at first, but I would play it if I were playing with a band or with the record more like this. And that's just adding just a little bit of palm mute. Fifth fret of our A string. 7th fret, 5th fret, do, 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 do. and that'll repeat itself, 5, 7, 5, 5, 7, 5, boop, 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 we're going to run through it again, 5, 7, 5, the 4th time through, we're going to hit that 5th fret 2 times. Okay, so the whole thing would be same notes, same order. The only difference is the fourth time through, you're going to hit that particular note two times. So let's play through that two times together. Okay, and then we get into the tune. Now the rest of the tune is only four chords for the entire song. You're going to need an E minor. Now this I'm going to play in open chords. You could play this on an acoustic or an electric. Um, you could play that E minor up here as well if you're on an electric. You're going to need an A major. Easy open chord. The bar chord would sound great as well. You're going to need a D major. I think that this, the cowboy chord version of this, which is what we're going to use, is the easiest. Kind of sounds the worst, and this D shape actually sounds a little better. And lastly, we're going to need a B minor, which comes from the E shape, if you don't know, and we only have the bar chord available. But if you're using the other bar chords, you can also grab that B minor up here. Oop, A minor. B minor, okay? All right, so the chord progression is gonna be two beats of E minor, two of uh, A, oops, two of D, two of B minor. So, so if we count more in time with the tune, we get something like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Come and get your love. All those open chords doesn't sound very good. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do down, 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 up over each chord. Down, 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 up for our strum pattern. If you no 
know how to count music, it's one, two, and a three, four, and a 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 one. The bar chords would be see that's where the palm muting comes in because that D is so bright it's gonna sound better if you can get some palm muting in there one two and a three four and a, oops one two and a three four and a one two and a three four hey hey what's the matter with your side and your mind and I play a solo and the intro riff is a good place to start with that so that was it that's the classic red bone tune super easy just those four chords turn it up play along and you'll get the tune in no time and until next time keep on rocking and rolling keep on loving life keep on playing the guitar because life is good my friends take care of yourselves Thank you so much for watching the very end. Tyler from 10thumbspro.com. Check out the site, other learning, other goodies over there. Think about becoming a Patreon. Printable tabs for this guitar tutorial and all our guitar tutorials. Um, what else? Skype lessons one on one. Email me 10thumbsproductions at gmail.com. Plus, you get some 10 Thumbs t shirts up in those notes as well if you want to represent, represent, and let them know where you're learning. Have a lovely day, and until next time, keep on rocking, keep on rolling, and come and get this love. <laughs> Take care. Bye.